On Thursday, May 30th, Pikeville Medical Center hosted their Awards Banquet 2024, where they honored one of their most dedicated employees. Cheryl Hickman has been employed at PMC for over 50 years and is this year's recipient of their Nurse of the Year Award. She now plans to retire at the beginning of July after a half century of service. This is a phenomenal event for us. It's one that I look forward to every year. It's an opportunity for us to not only acknowledge our accomplishments through the last year, but also uh, to acknowledge those employees who have done such an outstanding job in the name of healthcare and representing not only the PMC brand, but actually understanding and knowing what it takes to, to operate healthcare and to take care of, of our, uh, our patients. Our nurse of the year, uh, Cheryl Hickman, who's now been uh, with the organization for 50 years and will be retiring in July, uh, was honored today by our chief nursing officer and staff as being, again, uh, named and awarded uh, the, uh, the nurse of the year. Appalachian Wireless, where your connections matter the most. Right now, get up to $550 off select devices on new or renewed line with the Appalachian Unlimited or Mix and Match plan. Offer good in-store only. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. Hickman began volunteering in Kentucky as far back as 1969. She says her reason for seeking employment with PMC is that it felt like home to her. Well, it does, first of all, it doesn't feel like 50 years. It really doesn't. And time just keeps going and goes very quickly. Um, I came here as a volunteer in 1969, Eastern Kentucky, and then the University of Kentucky opened up a two, two-year program of nursing at Prestonsburg, hopped into it, and then I wanted to go somewhere in a hospital that was bigger and I hadn't really done clinicals in, so I came to Pikeville. And then I met my husband here had a family here, and it was home, and it's always been home. I was originally born in Charleston, West Virginia, and grew up in New Jersey, raised. So the concrete and I never really quite mixed. I was always, and when I got here, I knew I was home. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.